In one of your proposals to be put forward at China's two sessions this year, you suggest building a digital security system which can be seen and speeding up the construction of China's digital security infrastructure. Tell us more about this. Over the last few years, we have helped many governments and large enterprises with cybersecurity services. Those include discovering and resisting attacks. But in recent years, with the expanding digitization in China, more and more government departments, enterprises, and digital systems need security protection. Thus, we suggest building a connected digital infrastructure using our cloud-based cybersecurity services. With these. The security systems can be integrated and achieve collaborative defense. This will also reduce costs incurred by government departments and enterprises for cybersecurity services. At the beginning of this year, OpenAI stumped the world with Sora, its newest AI innovation that generates realistic videos from simple text descriptions. We noted that you have commented on the functions of Sora on many occasions. For example, you said, well, Sora would shorten the realization of artificial general intelligence or AGI from 10 years to 2 to 3 years. What made you say so? I think OpenAI is on the right track. First, it chooses to use the transformer language model, which was actually developed by Google. Then, it uses the model to not only process text information, but also image and video information. Our enterprises should learn from that. In terms of AGI, I believe ChatGPT has solved the problems of communication between computers and humans. Sora has shown the capability of making the world simulated by it look real. For example, snow is soft, water has fluidity. Such information needs observation and common understanding of life. Sara, therefore, has a deep understanding of the world, which would go to help enhance interactions between the computer and the world. That's why I say Sara in the future would help in the development of robots, autonomous driving, and also improve the accuracy of scientific calculations. You had mentioned that 2023 is the year of the big model, and in your words, some of the U.S. companies are all in AI. So you believe Chinese enterprises should also use AI to enhance their global competitiveness. Why do you say this? And how big is the gap between China and the United States in terms of development of AI technology? I believe that when it comes to AI, the development gap between China and the United States is about two years. But we're not sure whether there are other secret weapons of open AI, such as ChatGPT-5. Sam Altman is good at shocking everyone. In fact, the gap lies in the following aspects. First, I believe China needs to cultivate its AI talents. Second, we need to enhance our computing power. Then, it is knowledge. Having a great amount of data does not necessarily mean one can train a good model. We need to have knowledge about all of humanity. At the same time, we need to not only develop the big model, but also make those big models smaller, which means putting these big models into specific areas and making them more specialized. Only then, those big models can be effectively used in enterprises, and AI will truly be bringing another industrial revolution for humanity.